host, producer, and member of the Today Show's Style Squad, Liliana Vasquez. Star of the film Acrimony and Miss USA 2008, Crystal Stewart Seabrex. Co founder and CEO of It Cosmetics, Jamie Kern Lima. CEO and founder of EAG Sports Management, Denise White. Former host of HLN's Weekend Express with Natasha Curry, Natasha Curry. All right, let's give another round of applause for our selection committee. That is no easy job. Yesterday, they interviewed each contestant individually, and tonight they'll cast their votes in the swimsuit and evening gown competitions. And this year, you can help your favorite contestant get into the semifinals at the 2018 Miss USA telecast. Just head on over to vote.missusa.com. You get 10 votes per day. That's a lot. Be wise with your selections. The contestants will be back out here shortly. And when they walk across the stage one by one, we're going to tell you a bit about them. And yes, once again, each of their biographies will end in a rhyming couplet in tradition of the Miss USA competition. Are you guys ready to learn about the contestants? Woo! All right, let's let it begin. Let's begin the 2018 Miss USA preliminary swimsuit competition with... Alabama. Alabama graduated magna cum laude with a degree in communications and information sciences. This 23-year-old has raised over $15,000 volunteering for the Children's Miracle Network Hospitals. She's smart and has a big heart. Alabama. Alaska. Alaska has a bachelor's degree in digital cinema arts. This 25-year-old directed, produced, co-wrote, and starred in her senior thesis film, which was an official selection at the St. Louis Filmmaker Showcase. It sure is groovy to make a movie when you're Alaska. Arizona. Arizona graduated from cosmetology school in 2012. Last year, this 24-year-old entrepreneur began running her own hair and makeup tanning company. This makeup whiz started her own biz in Arizona. Arkansas. Arkansas enjoys educating others on the importance of gun safety and recently received her concealed carry license. This 21-year-old once helped identify a bank robber and received a $1,000 reward. It's sublime to stop a crime when you're Arkansas. California. California once worked as a red carpet host at the Country Music Awards. This six foot two, 25 year old played volleyball for 12 years and was captain of a nationally ranked college team. This contestant is striking, whether she's hosting or spiking, California. Colorado. Colorado works as an orthopedic sales consultant. This 22-year-old provides support to surgeons in the operating room, helping to facilitate a smooth and successful surgery. Everything remains stable on the operating table with Colorado. Connecticut. Connecticut once helped save the life of an unconscious stranger. In college, this 27-year-old minored in music performance and is trained to sing classically in five languages. This singer will strive to keep you alive. It's Connecticut. Delaware. Delaware has been playing softball for 15 years. This 20-year-old sports fan spent the past two seasons as a ball girl for the Philadelphia Phillies. Her first love involves a bat and a glove. It's Delaware. <laughs> District of Columbia. District of Columbia currently owns and operates her own cake business. This 21-year-old entrepreneur hopes to eventually have a storefront bakery in the Georgetown area of Washington, D.C. When it comes to baking, she's a star in the making. District of Columbia. Florida. Florida plans to pursue a graduate degree in nonprofit management and leadership. During last year's hurricane season, this 27-year-old brought primary care from her state to affected Caribbean regions. With a knack for giving back, it's Florida. Alaska, Arizona.
Arizona, Arkansas, California, Colorado, Connecticut, Delaware, District of Columbia, and Florida. Georgia. Georgia is an international affairs major who speaks three languages. In 2016, this 25-year-old was cast in a Colombian TV series that was the country's most watched show last year. This beauty queen sure can light up the screen. Georgia! Hawaii. Hawaii enjoys writing children's books using characters inspired by her three miniature dachshunds. Last fall, this 26-year-old had the opportunity to walk the runway at New York Fashion Week. It takes both brains and looks to model and write books like Hawaii. Idaho. Idaho graduated from Boise State University two years early with high honors. This 21-year-old is part of a healthcare team that helps heal and strengthen patients after strokes and spinal cord injuries. This go-getter helps patients feel better. Idaho! Illinois. Illinois traveled to Peru on a service trip and helped build a greenhouse for a family in need. This 20-year-old first-generation American has dual citizenship in the United States and Poland. If she doesn't travel, her whole world would unravel. Illinois! Indiana. Indiana works as the cadaver dissection intern for Bethel College. And tw this 23-year-old recently established a partnership with a donor network advocating for organ donation. Throughout her state, going under the knife just might save a life, Indiana. Iowa. Iowa is currently the afternoon on-air personality for a radio station in her home state. This 27-year-old plans to eventually become a radio or TV host in a top 20 media market. You can search coast to coast, but you won't find another host like I was. Kansas. Kansas has an entire dresser filled with makeup products at home. This 20-year-old former cheerleader aspires to be the chief marketing officer for a major cosmetic company one day. Looking to shake up the world of makeup, it's Kansas. Kentucky. Kentucky created an annual leadership conference for teen girls in 2015. This 25-year-old entrepreneur's program is designed to assist young women in paving the way for a bright future. This beauty queen knows how to mentor a teen. Kentucky! Louisiana! Louisiana is the morning news anchor for Channel 6 out of Shreveport. This 28-year-old is also an athlete and once played soccer for the Olympic Development Program. You just can't lose delivering goals in the news like Louisiana. Maine. Maine is a sergeant in the U.S. Army. This 23-year-old calls it an honor to be a woman in the military and last summer received recognition as non-commissioned officer of the year. She's worthy of a crown in fatigues or a gown. It's Maine. Massachusetts was diagnosed with a rare autoimmune disease at 11 and underwent non-invasive chemo. Now 27, she is working towards her MBA with a concentration in healthcare. She proved she's a fighter and is now making the world brighter. Massachusetts! Michigan. 
Michigan is currently an ambassador for Light Up Detroit, celebrating growth and pride for the city. This 25-year-old student is well-trained in the military self-defense fighting technique, Krav Maga. The future is bright for this queen who can fight, Michigan! Minnesota. Minnesota is passionate about performing music. This 25-year-old began writing songs and playing guitar a decade ago and recently sang the national anthem in front of 7,000 people at an international raceway in her home state. We'd swoon if we heard a tune for Minnesota. Mississippi. Mississippi is the published author of a book designed to inspire and empower women. In addition to writing, this 21-year-old works as a wedding photographer. This author takes pride in snapping pics of the bride. It's Mississippi! Missouri! Missouri is a freelance sports reporter and admires Erin Andrews for her success in a male-dominated field. This 27-year-old has traveled around nine Canadian provinces and 48 states in an RV. She found a unique way to see the whole USA. Missouri! Montana. Montana is inspired by former Miss Universe Olivia Popo, whom she calls a girl boss. This 28-year-old UFC fan has an online clothing boutique providing thoughtfully selected interview wardrobes for women. Her clothes are desired by those looking to get hired. Montana! Nebraska. Nebraska studied in Peru where she visited remote villages, slept in the Amazon basin, and hiked in Machu Picchu. This 23-year-old part-time Pilates instructor is first aid, CPR, and AED certified by the Red Cross. She's traveled Peru and can save a life too. Nebraska! Nevada. Nevada was briefly homeless, so she's now an advocate for disadvantaged youth. At 23, this model has already shot ads for several national campaigns, including Forever 21, Nordstrom, and Target. If you open a magazine, then you've probably seen Nevada. New Hampshire. New Hampshire has a degree in hospitality management and works as a real estate agent. This 25-year-old started figure skating 20 years ago and continued competing throughout college, selling homes that are nice while looking great on the ice. New Hampshire! Massachusetts, Michigan, Minnesota, Mississippi, Missouri, Montana, Nebraska, Nevada, and New Hampshire. New Jersey. New Jersey is studying criminal justice with plans to pursue a career in law enforcement. After years of training in judo, this 23-year-old is now a first-degree black belt. And a sash and a crown, she can knock you down. New Jersey! New Mexico. New Mexico has a bachelor's degree in mechanical engineering. This 23-year-old is currently pursuing her master's in industrial engineering while working as a contractor with Raytheon. Let's all cheer for this engineer, New Mexico! New York. New York is a men's skincare specialist, but plans to start her own real estate business. This 26-year-old has participated in numerous marathons for causes logging over 800 miles. In the past two years, fixing men's skin while racing to win, it's New York. North Carolina. As a toddler, North Carolina contracted a virus that led to inflammation of the brain. This 22-year-old suffered a complete loss of muscle control, and doctors only gave her a 10% chance of walking again. The journey was long, but she proved those dogs wrong. North Carolina! North Dakota. 
North Dakota is currently pursuing an undergraduate degree in psychology. This 20-year-old plans to continue on to medical school with the ultimate goal of becoming a trauma surgeon. She's a future star in the ER, North Dakota. Ohio. Ohio is the founder of Queen Bee, a company that produces organic honey. This 20-year-old beekeeper holds workshops to help other young entrepreneurs launch their own businesses. Selling natural honey makes this queen bee money, Ohio. Oklahoma. Oklahoma has been a competitive dancer for 13 years at a national level. This 20-year-old is a member of a group at her university that writes and performs live comedic skits for other students. If you think this dancer's funny, you'd be right on the money, Oklahoma. Oregon. Oregon is the CEO and designer for an online store specializing in activewear. This 22-year-old was once a contestant on a reality show where she was lowered into a tank full of eels and had bugs poured over her head. Comfortable in heels or a tank full of eels, it's Oregon! Pennsylvania. Pennsylvania studied abroad in Florence, Italy and is pursuing a career in the fashion industry. This 22-year-old currently runs an e-retail business that markets tailored clothing to young, professional women. Fashion is her passion, Pennsylvania! Rhode Island. Rhode Island has a baking and pastry arts degree and is currently in school working towards a bachelor's in food service management. This 22-year-old is food safety certified and hopes to open her own bakery one day. If you're looking for cakes, this contestant bakes. Rhode Island! New Jersey, New Mexico, New York, North Carolina, North Dakota, Ohio, Oklahoma, Oregon, Pennsylvania, and Rhode Island. South Carolina. South Carolina has spent 15 years learning to ride and care for horses at an expert level. This 23-year-old equestrian enjoys practicing show jumping, dressage, and eventing. She could teach courses on how to ride horses. South Carolina. South Dakota. South Dakota is a biology student who models for a clothing boutique. In a few years, this 21-year-old plans to attend dental school and eventually open her own dentistry practice. It's the truth. She'll fix your tooth. South Dakota. Tennessee. Tennessee is passionate about fighting hunger and has volunteered at a food bank for the past 15 years. Pageantry is in her genes as the 25-year-old's mother was also crowned Miss Tennessee USA in 1981. Her crown was passed down. It's Tennessee. Texas. Texas recently became the youngest realtor in her office to sell a million-dollar home. This 23-year-old's proudest accomplishment was being recognized on the Houston Association of Realtors exclusive 20 under 40 list last year. If you need a new dwelling, this contestant is selling. Texas! Utah. Utah didn't speak English when she came to the U.S., but learned quickly and won a spelling bee. Within a year, this 24-year-old American Armenian advocates for higher education for immigrants as she understands the challenges they face. Learning is grand when you're from a foreign land like Utah. Vermont. Vermont is a member of the United States Parachute Association, working to become a professional skydiver. This 20-year-old has been training for two years and has accumulated nearly 200 solo jumps. It's not insane to jump out of a plane when you're Vermont. Virginia. Virginia is a multimedia journalism major and aspiring sports broadcaster. This 22-year-old, Allie 
sports fan, worked last year's WNBA Finals, but her ultimate goal is to report from the sidelines of the Super Bowl. Reporting on sports of all sorts, it's Virginia! Washington. Washington hopes to raise national awareness about the dangers of texting and driving. This 20-year-old enjoys welding in her spare time and even has her own sparkly pink welder's mask. Feeling compelled to weld, it's Washington! West Virginia. West Virginia has a degree in biochemistry and was recently accepted into graduate school. This 21-year-old plans to be a physician's assistant specializing in gynecology and women's health care. She has a wealth of knowledge from studying health in college, West Virginia. Wisconsin. Wisconsin's career goal is to be the lead anchor on a national news network. This 27-year-old former communications major was accepted to every college she applied to and awarded over $200,000 in scholarships. Before earning her sash, she was granted scholarship cash. Wisconsin! Wyoming! Wyoming is a yoga teacher who describes herself as a hardcore vegetarian. It's been quite a transformation for this 28-year-old who was nicknamed Cali the Carnivore in college for eating bacon every day. There's no pork on her fork, Wyoming.